Good evening, everyone. I'm meteorologist Katie McNeil. You've now clicked on the Weather Now link. Let's jump right into it. Take a look outside right now. Visibility looking good for the time being, although we could see some patchy fog overnight tonight with very high dew points as we head towards your Sunday morning. The good news is we'll see slightly lower dew points towards the late morning and afternoon tomorrow, leading way to a little bit of relief from that tropical humidity and moisture that we've been seeing. Unfortunately, though, that'll be ramping right back up as we head towards Monday through Wednesday with very warm temperatures, highs in the 90s. Right now, we're still mild outside with temperatures in the low 70s. We'll be seeing overnight lows above average again around 70 as we head towards the overnight hours. And I mentioned the heat here. We do have a heat advisory which will be in effect across our area for Providence, Kent County, Northern Bristol County, and Massachusetts from Monday at 8 a.m. until Monday 8 p.m. with heat index values potentially that could reach up to 102 degrees. So warmer heat index values than we saw with the first potential heat wave. We do have the potential for another heat wave, again, starting tomorrow on Sunday and then continuing through Wednesday. With that, taking a step forward towards Tuesday, there is an excessive heat watch in place with heat index values even higher, potentially up to 107 degrees, and this will be for all of Rhode Island and southeastern Massachusetts. Nevertheless, we're going to be keeping a very close eye on this in the next couple days, but oppressive and potentially dangerous heat coming up in the next few days. So be mindful if you're spending time out and about. Try to limit outdoor sun exposure and time and stay hydrated if you are going to be outside for longer periods of time as heat this high could lead to heat exhaustion fairly quickly and dehydration. In the meantime, overnight tonight, quiet night outside of the patchy fog will be staying a lot drier here leading way to a pretty warm start to your morning already in the upper 70s around 80 by 8 o'clock. That'll lead to a very quick warm up by midday in the afternoon with highs around 90 degrees. The only difference with tomorrow and Monday through Wednesday as far as the heat advisory distinction is the fact that the dew points will be a little bit lower kind of barring that heat index from reaching uh, high values that we're seeing Monday, Tuesday and potentially Wednesday as well. Nevertheless, a lot of sunshine will still be a very warm day throughout the afternoon hours tomorrow on Sunday. Temperatures will still be mild as we head towards the overnight with temperatures still in the upper 70s at 11 o'clock tomorrow evening. Overnight temperatures will be warm as well, above average with high humidity kicking back in, especially Monday through Wednesday again. So your Sunday morning, look at those partly sunny conditions from any lingering fog early. That'll lead way towards increasing sunshine by the late morning and early afternoon. Temperatures quickly warming up into the 80s by midday with your highs again very warm around 90 with plenty of sunshine. So we have another uh, warm day on tap. A lot more sunshine than what we saw today, which will really allow those temperatures to jump up. Again, the major distinction, though, between tomorrow and Monday is that lack of humidity or lower humidity than what we're going to be seeing on Monday, hence why those heat index values are so much higher as we head towards the start of your work week. But nevertheless, again, a very warm day tomorrow with the more intense heat kicking in Monday through Wednesday. So stay, stay safe out there. Stay safe out there if you're going to be spending time outdoors. We'll be keeping a close eye on the heat index values and any updated advisories in the coming days. And as always, you can get your full forecast anytime at WPRI.com.